My name's Malin, and in this video I wanted to talk about discipline over motivation. As I've kind of said, there's been three videos. There's been enjoyment over struggle, there's been consistency over perfection, and now there's discipline over motivation. And these are three ideas that I got from Taylor Allen from Deep Game. Go check out his stuff. He's not doing Deep Game anymore, he's just doing Taylor Allen stuff, and he's into kind of very deep self-help you know under the surface kind of taking spirituality into it anyway so discipline over motivation if you kind of notice your mind you'll see that when you want to do all these kind of different things and some days you'll feel motivated to do one thing other days you feel motivated to do another and you know in some online spaces in the self-help spaces there's like this idea that you shouldn't have motivation. You should just go and be disciplined and do things. And this is, this is kind of an important thing because if we follow the motivation, we'll notice that our mind fluctuates and it will want all these different things. One day it'll want a cookie and the next day it'll want an apple. And then the next day it'll want, I don't know, who knows what, like each day it kind of changes. And if we're always floating around with it, then you can see in our life that it's going to be taking us in all these different directions and it's never really going to lead anywhere and build anything that's going to be impactful in our lives. So this is the importance of discipline and discipline doesn't have to be this big massive kind of thing, you know. It can it takes time to build habits and habits become automatic behavior and this makes life a bit easier because then you have kind of a structure to follow. And it takes discipline to do these things, to choose one thing instead of another. But it's, uh, it's a skill that you can build up and you can develop in yourself. And how do you develop it? You develop it by deciding on something and sticking on it and making a promise to yourself and seeing it through and building that trust with yourself. And it's important to kind of do something that's easy, which is the importance of enjoyment over struggle choosing something that is kind of easy for you to do, that you want to do, because productivity and discipline isn't just doing the things that you don't feel like doing or the things that need to be done. It's, it's important to do something that's going to be long lasting and sustainable, which is something that you're going to enjoy, that you get some sort of benefit from. Not everything's going to be perfect like that, but there should be some sort of sense of fulfillment afterwards or kind of enjoyment through it. So for example, for me, this is working out. Like sometimes it sucks to kind of work out and to do these sorts of things and, you know, lift the weights and it really hurts to, to, to do that at times. But afterwards it's like a fulfillment and that kind of over time, it kind of feeds this um, feedback loop. And then, you know, it, I, become, I see more and more progress and I feel more and more better as I do it. And that's the importance of discipline is that you've got to stick to it over time because as i said you know if we're relying on motivation then no, things aren't really going to get done and we're going to be going off in all these different directions and we're not really going to be having anything that's going to feel fulfilling or meaningful in our lives and that's the power of humans we have the power to choose to do what we want to do to create a life that we would more like to have and that happens in the day to day that happens in the now it's not some big task that you have to do it's not some big thing out there in the future it's just day to day it's taking out the trash it's eating a bit more salad it's you know having an apple instead of a chocolate bar or a candy bar or whatever you have and just having these little tiny kind of things that just add up and you know build your discipline and then your life becomes a lot more better and more wholesome so thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.